So I am going to make my cross Jesus necklace. I did add links to my website for just these specific necklaces in gold tone, rose gold tone, and silver. So here we go. You're gonna start with a loop at the top. Just like this. And then you're gonna add some beads if you would like. I do two on the top, one on the bottom. Bring those all the way to the top and then I'm gonna grab it with my tweezer nose pliers almost up to the bead and I'm gonna bend it off to the side so we have a right angle and then I'm going to however wide I want my cross and the J so about right here I'm gonna fold it on itself just like this and I'm going to pinch that closed with my little ch channel round nose pliers, holding that aligned. I want to keep that aligned and I want to pinch this at the same time, just like that. So one on top of the other. Then I'm going to go down to the other side of the cross. And I want this about the same length because the cross is going to be like this. And I'm going to bring my wire around and down. And that is the J. Now I really want the rest of his name to be in the aligned in the middle. I'm going to bend that a little bit more. There we go. So for my E, I'm going to hold it here and I'm going to bring it down behind it and sorry, there's no teeth on the, the um, small nose pliers so it doesn't mar the wire as much so it kind of wiggles around when I'm moving it. So I'm going to squeeze the top of the E to even out, even it out a little. So I want the E to be right in the center. Now I'm going to make my S. I'm going to push my wire over to the side a little bit. Give it a little bit of an angle. Then I'm going to bring my wire back on itself. Just like that. I'm going to pinch it down a little bit. And then I'm going to bring this wire over and that's going to be the top of the S. And then I use my round nose pliers and I grab it like this and I bring the wire back around and behind. I'm going to keep going and then I'm going to bring just the very tip in the circle and go around just like that then I want to pinch that closed okay so now we have the JES and as you can see the S needs to bend up a little bit there we go now I'm just gonna hold the bottom wire and I'm gonna bring the wire up and around to make the U There's a close-up so far. Grab my other pliers and hold it. Bend it back on itself. Just like that. Then bring it around. And see how this is more this way. I'm going to push this back so it's aligned. Then grab it again, bring the wire back on itself, pinch it, bring the wire back around, and then make our last S, 
making sure everything aligns on the top pretty much on the bottom and the bottom my s always goes up a little bit more it's just it ends up being a bigger letter i'm going to bend that over back on itself pinch it a little bit hold it and bring the wire this way and then i'm going to pinch it again there's the top of the S. Grab it with my round nose pliers. Bring it around and under. I want it behind. Bring it down to the very small tip and down. Pinch that. And then this S needs to bend a little bit forward. And now I want the bottom part of the cross to align with that one. So I'm going to grab that circle that I made and I'm going to bring my wire out and try to make sure that the top aligns with the bottom. Now I'm going to add another bead. I'm going to cut off the excess. And then I'm just going to curl this around to end it and pinch it. Because we don't want that to be scratchy on anybody's neck. So there is our Jesus cross. And now I'm just going to put a chain through the top. Ooh. And these are available on my website. I will link that in the description of this video if you would like to purchase one I'm going to add a jump ring to that end close it up and there is our my necklace says Jesus with some beautiful like root beer colored rhinestones. Thank you for watching. I love you. Oh, God bless. Bye.